If you want to stay up to date with all current hip hop events and releases, make sure to subscribe and become part of this community. Oh, and also go cop that fresh merch and listen to my new album in the description. All right, y'all probably know that A Boogie with a Hoodie was supposed to release his new album, A Boogie vs. Artist, you know, for some time now. And he's been teasing at it for over a year. I mean, th this thing has been in the talks for like years, but really like teasing at it on social media, being like, you know, it's about to be done and about to drop. I think it's been over a year now honestly that i've also been talking about this thing on my channel so this has been a long time and today or actually you know last friday on december 10th when new music dropped we got a step closer to the album maybe a bit disappointingly for some fans because this album was at some point also supposed to come out this december so a lot of people were thinking you know last week the 10th or now coming up the next couple of Fridays that we still got you know we got the 17th and then the 24th and 31st although I already said in a couple of other videos it's unlikely that you know huge albums will release on those days just because people are probably spending those days with family or you know just somewhere else so then it came as a surprise when we saw that he dropped a new EP he announced this thing on social media saying he's back and let's look at this new EP because of, of course there are some interesting things that we can pick out of this first of all the album is called or the ep it's not an album obviously the album is a boogie versus artist um you know that that title stands for the two personalities the two characters that his music has on one side we got a boogie that's like his rap um persona and on the other side artist which is his actual legal name this man this first name is artist i think that's still so dope to this day and those kind of contrasting because you know he got um a, you know he got tapes that are called artists and artist 2.0 and then on other tapes like the bigger artist that's like his you know artist persona and then on the tapes uh for example hoodie season he went into his a boogie um kind of persona as just this rapper that's not talking about his feelings but rather making more turn up songs that is kind of this duality in his personas that he's he's wanting to display both of them on this new record a boogie versus artist which i think is a cool concept because fans have been loving both of them um but let's look at this new album it's called or ep i always say album uh it's called before ava so it's called uh before a boogie versus artist which obviously already hints at the fact that this will be somewhat of a prequel to the album that's still to come because we all know a boogie versus artist is still coming now probably earlier on next year probably january february i'm thinking um but you know to name i always like when artists drop these little eps and to name them something that is then supposed to build hype for an upcoming bigger project um i think i'll I always like that I always like that was a little like sneak peek as to what we can expect from this tape um, which I think is really cool let's also talk about the album cover real quick before we get into the tracks because I think this album cover looks absolutely gorgeous it is in such high definition and such high quality and so cinematic it feels like this is you know rendered obviously but in like a very realistic way this is super realistic and I think it looks dope straight out of a movie and we can see him uh, um, in his a boogie persona standing over this little like pond and in the pond we see a reflection in the water of uh, artist his his real name his real persona being reflected uh, on this cover as well so you know this duality again between the two i think kind of looks like he's on like a different planet somewhere but anyway uh, at the top of um the cover art it also says a boogie versus artist so i'm thinking that maybe this will also be the cover art for the album that we end up getting because it says a boogie versus artist and not before ava because uh, otherwise he would have chosen a different cover art maybe he wants to tease at it already if so i think that this album cover looks absolutely gorgeous as i said so he could very well you know just roll with it and go with this one for the actual album that's about to come i'd have no problem with that looking at the actual music we got on this thing though we have seven tracks one of them we've already heard that was that 24 hours track 
track with Lil Durk, which did pretty well. I also liked the track. I thought Durkio's part was um, pretty good on here. It's only featured as a bonus track on this EP, um, so the other six ones are obviously where most of the attention goes. It's been doing pretty all right in terms of numbers uh, because, you know, some people were starving for some new A Boogie, and I think, you know, if he calls this thing before AVA, more people are going to listen to the actual album once it comes out which i think is a pretty great uh, marketing move for him so six new tracks all of which i really liked we definitely see that contrast between the a boogie and artist persona for example on girls go down or also the first track man in the mirror uh this is like the a boogie just going hard type style even though it's mixed in a lot of ways you can't really always say that this track is a boogie this track is artist but obviously that is also that's not what he wants to do he wants to combine both of them and it's not like we didn't have those a boogie tracks exclusively on a boogie tapes and not on artist tapes and vice versa so it's obviously always like blending together but then on other tracks like notifications or making you cry he's more in touch with that artist persona that we especially saw on that first artist tape back in 2016 that he rose to fame with and on later you know later tapes to come international artist and the bigger artist artist 2.0 so i definitely like to see that i like that he really gave us like you you know that taste of what's to come i don't think that these tracks will be featured on the actual album because you know otherwise he wouldn't name this before a boogie versus artist but rather like you know release them as singles um but i do like if they're not on there then shout outs to my man a boogie for taking the time to make these six new tracks or seven in total you know in the same style as the album with that contrast just to put them out as like you know hype makers for it which is, that's a lot of dedication that's a lot of work and i think that should be commended um and for for giving us something to uh, bridge the gap in between the time that it still takes for this thing to release i mean it's been almost two years since we got the last project from him which was artist 2.0 which i really liked back when it dropped in i think it was february or january of 2020 and obviously we are getting close to that anniversary again so it's about to uh you know it's about to be a long time since he last dropped and that's why i think that this could drop around the same time that we saw artist 2.0 drop so as i said early 2022 probably january or february that's my guess so far but yeah this new a boogie ep before a boogie versus artist i really like that i could listen to every track on here i love the cover art i really hope that he still goes with this on the actual album that's so you know they're still coming and i think that it's dropping as i said january february that's my guess but obviously that's just my opinion and my theories on this now i want to know what you think about this are you excited for a boogie versus artist what was your you know thoughts when you first heard this new tape before ava do you think that he's still using that cover art on the final project or still something new definitely all of your thoughts and opinions let me know in the comments down below if you watched this video to the end and liked it and you want to stay up to date with all current hip-hop events and releases make sure to subscribe turn on notifications hit that like button and go follow my social media and blog down in the description it really helps me out until the next one Y'all have an incredible day and y'all take care.